Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a what I eat in a day to lose the weight that I've been losing. I'm down 31 and a half pounds. And the first thing that I do in the morning, recently in the past few days, I started to get on the elliptical because we just got it inside. Here I'm like talking myself into getting on the elliptical. Takes me a little bit because it's so early in the morning, but this is something that I've just recently added to my routine. Workout is done. The kids ended up draining me. So it took me way longer because I had to get a DVD set up for them. I'm a hot mess. I'm gonna make some eggs. Let me show you what I'm making for breakfast today. Next up on my what I eat in a day, I just had another iced coffee, which may or may not have been a good idea for raging anxiety, but also energy. Energy, anxiety, I'm not sure. And then for lunch today, I'm super excited because last week I ordered Eat to Evolve pre-made meals, and these are all keto friendly, which I'm pumped about, especially since my days have been so insane lately, trying to catch up from being sick last week. I need a break and this is gonna catch me a little bit of a break and I'm out of wings today so seriously this is going to be a blessing. Order before 10 a.m. Central Standard Time every single Friday. You will have your order shipped out the next Monday and I received it this morning Thursday. Wednesday, Thursday is about when you will receive your shipment in and I'm super excited to try them out. If you guys want to try them out I do have a 20% off discount which I will have linked down below and I'll have their website linked up here for you guys as well. I'm super excited because I've never found a pre-made meal service that offers keto. So they also offer different um, like ways and lifestyles of eating. I've got Riker in the background, so just bear with me. It is nap time and he is boycotting his naps. So that's so awesome. They also offer Paleo Evolve 30, primal way of eating. They've got dairy-free, gluten-free, low calorie, anything that you are looking for, they have in their pre-made meal service. So. I'm gonna jump on into the meals that I got and I'm so excited to see what came in my box because I am starving and I cannot wait to see what I'm going to eat first. So let's hop on into the box. All right, so the food comes in an insulated box um, and then it goes over all of the like deadlines and the rules. So again, order deadline is 10 a.m. Central Standard Time on Fridays for Monday shipment and it says to allow two to three days for arrival. Um, everything is recyclable in this container, which is awesome. There's an eat or freeze by date, tells you how to freeze it, fresh, never frozen, and it talks a little bit about shipping. So 
this is a nice little doodad for you to check out. Um, and then, first up we've got carne asada with cauliflower rice. Super bomb, you guys know the cauliflower rice is one of my go-tos. On the back of the containers, it also gives you all of the information um, so that you can plug it right into MyFitnessPal if that's what you use, like I do. Um, everything is right on the back for you. So um, it gives you like all the net carbs and all the important information. Uh, this one is a buffalo chicken burger. Ooh, with broccoli and bacon salad. That looks delicious. So next up, I have the bruschetta turkey burger with grilled zucchini planks. Then we've got some Cajun chicken thighs and broccoli. This is definitely a meal that I've eaten many times. Steak tips, peppers, and onions. Ooh, also a favorite of mine. Um, and it has some broccoli in there. This is a beef and broccoli. Ooh, the sesame seeds on top look so good. I will give you guys a review of each of these as well, whether it be over on my Instagram or my TikTok or on here. Make sure that you guys are following me on all of my socials down below so that you can check out the reviews for the foods. Next up, we've got some sesame crusted chicken and ginger scallion cauliflower rice. Wow, okay, that sounds bomb. And it comes with a sauce in there as well. All of these are vacuum sealed and like very, very well packaged. I will say that is one of my first impressions. Um, and then I have grilled chicken with green beans. That looks so good. Look at those marks with grill marks. All right, and then we've got fried chicken with spaghetti squash and marinara. Ooh, yes. I love spaghetti squash so much. And then last but not least, we've got a taco bowl. Definitely up my alley. I have these all the time. Again, such a lifesaver that these are pre-packaged, ready to go. All you need to do is heat them up. All 10 meals, ready to go. Like I said, the rest of this package is recyclable, so we're gonna toss that in the recycling bin. And I think for today, oh, I need to decide. I think for today, I am going to try the sesame crusted chicken for lunch. Honestly, all of these look so good, I can't really choose a favorite. This one sounds the most interesting to me because on my keto diet, sometimes my like ideas are limited, and this is definitely opening up a new like food idea for me. So I'm going to try this one first. But again, if you guys want to try out Eat to Evolve, I will have the 20% discount code and link down below for you guys. And again, they have a bunch of lifestyle eating choices. Riker is tossing paper towels down the stairs right now, so I'm going to toss this in the microwave and see if I can get my wild child to go back down for a nap. I am so excited. All right, so they do have it in my fitness pal. I scanned the barcode. Everything comes up right here for you. Okay, I've tried recording this several times, but the kids are insane right now. So for dinner, um, they're just having pizza rolls once or twice a week. I let them have whatever the heck they want for dinner. I've got chicken nuggets, pizza rolls, mac and cheese, and all of the normal things. We've got almond containers like dropping. Okay, so we also have been snacking on almonds. Um, these are some of our favorite. These are the Sweet Thai Chili, if I can get it to focus. Sweet Thai Chili by Blue Diamond. And these are so good. Um, these taste like the purple Doritos, if you have had those before. They're, these are so, so good. The kids and I love them, and I wish I could find them in a bigger container. Um, I'll have these linked down below for you, as well as the Eat to Evolve, so you guys can check that all out. Um, but yeah, these are awesome, like lifesavers when I'm craving like a naughty snack if I'm craving Doritos, these are awesome. Um, and then we, we also have the spicy dill pickle, which I think are so good. <laughs> like, Riker like makes the funniest face when he eats them. I keep feeding them to him because it's just so funny. And actually he'll, he likes them. It's just like the first, the first one is like a little bit of a shock for him. Anyway, it's, it's funny and the mom things, the mom things, I don't know. It's just so funny to me. Anyway, for dinner tonight, since the kids just had pizza rolls, so I wanted to give you guys a couple of other ideas for dinners that I typically rotate in. I usually just do a veggie with some kind of protein every single night, and last night we did T-bone steaks with um, cauliflower, or not cauliflower, that's what we're talking about. They were zucchini noodles, the veggie nests from 
Sam's Club. Those are so good. Um, and I mix it with a little bit of Alfredo sauce and I did a little bit of Chipotle powder in there. And then I topped it with some Parmesan cheese. So, so good. And then I also did um, bacon wrapped jalapeno poppers. So what you do is you take fresh jalapenos and then you core them out. So I will take them, I'll cut the tops off, slice them in half long ways and then I pour out the insides, I fill it up with cream cheese, and then I wrap it with a piece of bacon. They're so good, I just cook them in the oven, otherwise sometimes I'll put them on the smoker if I'm feeling patient enough, because they take a little bit longer on the smoker, but oh my gosh, they're so good. That is like one of my favorites to do. Otherwise, taco bowls, burrito bowls, with like um, the cauliflower rice that I showed you guys in Wednesday's video, so good. You could do like a cauliflower rice, like copycat of the Chipotle, um, burrito bowls that they have, the keto bowls they have now. Um, so, so, so good. Uh, another thing that I like to do for dinner is chicken thighs, and I really like artichoke, which those are higher in carbohydrates, but they're also higher in fiber. So if I have, and even like net carb wise, I believe they still come out to a little bit higher, but they're so good. So if I have enough carbs left in the day, I will steam a fresh artichoke, which I think I've showed you guys before here on my channel. Um, I will include in my next what I eat in a day, I'll include some artichokes so I can show you guys. The next what I eat in a day is going to be a whole week span. That's my goal. So I can give you guys all of the low carb slash keto ideas if you are on this journey along with me. So anyways, um, for dinner tonight, I am, like I said, since I just did pizza rolls for the kids, I'm eating another one of those eat to evolve meals. These are definitely things that I would cook anyways and they save me so much time, so much time. So if you are a busy mom, like I said, busy mom, busy businesswoman, um, mama on the go, like these are your go-tos. Um, I am trying to decide between the grilled chicken with green beans and this one's a little bit more of a simple meal, but it comes with a garlic herb ranch and, or like a roasted garlic ranch, it says. Ooh, not responsible for your future ranch addiction. You guys, I love, love ranch so much. I So that's why I'm gravitating towards this tonight because this looks super bomb. Um, otherwise, there's this bruschetta turkey burger with grilled zucchini planks. And this one has fresh ground turkey burger with a great tomato, bruschetta topping, and served with grilled zucchini plank planks. This is a really awesome meal. If you're trying to get your greens in, there's all sorts of goodies in here. Um, I am gonna go with this one for tonight because the ranch, I mean guys, the ranch just sounds so good. So anyway, this is what I'm gonna be eating um, for dinner. If you guys wanna check out Eat to Evolve, again, I have a code and a link down below for 20% off of your first order with them. Holy cow. These meals are so good and they're fresh made every weekend and then ship out on Monday. So they're, just, they're fresh, they're vacuum sealed like this. Oh my gosh, highly recommend them. I'm already obsessed. Um, I already put in another order for next week because it just, it saves me so much time. These are a lifesaver for me, like especially lunchtime when I'm on the go in the middle of the day. I'm on the phone, I'm messaging customers, I'm trying to get Riker down for a nap right after lunchtime. The kids are playing in the background and they're fighting, of course, so don't mind the chaos. But anyway, as you can see, Unless I'm doing a dinner that I can easily cater to both styles of eating, like a normal style slash my style. For example, like spaghetti is really easy because I can cook spaghetti noodles and my noodles at the same time and they use the same sauce. All right, it is mass chaos in here, so I'm going to go, but this is what I'm having for dinner tonight. Um, and the best thing about these, like I don't know why this is my favorite part, but if you guys use my fitness pal like I do, I think I mentioned this earlier, but you can just scan the barcode on the back and it automatically will pop up in my no, no. my fitness pal. Like, if you use the barcode scanner, it'll automatically pop up, and you're good to go. You don't have to worry about entering in all of the information. Just scan and go. It's so easy. Working in an office, staying at home, etc. Being a crazy busy mom. I need these, you need these, they're so good. Like I said, they've got like paleo, they've got primal way of eating, they have the Evolve 30, um, and then they have um, keto. They've got dairy free and gluten free and low calorie and low fat if you're on Weight Watchers. They've got all of the things to meet your needs. So anyways, go check them out. I highly, highly recommend them. 
All right, guys, I'm going to end it there for today. I hope you enjoyed this what I eat in a day. I hope I gave you some more ideas. I hope I gave you some motivation to hop on the weight loss train. If you've got a 2021 new year goal to lose some weight, come along with me, join my weight loss journey. I upload a weight loss related video once a week, give you guys weight loss updates. 31 and a half pounds down. I have about 48 and a half left to lose. So I still have quite a bit on my weight loss journey. All right, so the very end of the video got like totally destroyed. I have no idea what happened, if it just like ended, it just self-destructed, I have no idea. But anyways, I will see you guys on Monday on both of my channels for a couple of really fun videos. On my channel here, I'm going to be posting a day in the life and then over on the At Home with Morgan channel, which is launching next to Monday with a bathroom makeover. I am so excited. I worked so hard on this bathroom makeover so I can share it with you guys and to really like start this channel out with a bang. So make sure that you're subscribed to the At Home with Morgan channel, which is also linked down below and stay tuned because there is so much goodness coming for you guys on both of my channels in the next couple of weeks. If you want the weight loss motivation, like mom life motivation, cleaning motivation, like home decor, room makeovers, I've got you covered. Okay guys, I'll see you on Monday on both of my channels. Okay, bye.